Hello, it's me, Daryl, Florida Catholic guy. Uh, ooh, it's been a minute since I've posted any content. Uh, bear, bear with me. Uh, probably not going to be able to see much, but uh, you'll be here. You'll be able to hear me talk. <laughs> uh, just wanted to make a short video. Uh, Wishing you all Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Uh, and just give a little update, not much is going on. I mean, obviously just, uh, just uh, went through, got through Christmas. And next week, uh, or this coming Friday is New Year's Eve. Saturday is New Year's Day, obviously. And, uh, I don't know, just a lot of... Personally, for me, it hasn't been a bad year. I wouldn't say it's been an exceptionally good year, but it hasn't been bad. I mean, it's bad in the sense of what we got in the White House. And, uh, in Congress, but uh, not much you can do about that right we now. Because we don't transport people anywhere but to jail or to uh, Baker Act, and uh, she's not going to jail. She just wants to ride, so she has to find a friend. We don't do that. And uh, just to smell the skunk, I think it's actually people smoking pot. They do that. A lot up here. Uh, there was a group over there. Uh, but anyway, yeah. Hopefully, uh, next year we can get a at least a better Congress. <laughs> November elections. Uh, who knows? You know, they cheated. Last year, who knows, or, yeah, last year, who knows how they're going to cheat this year. And, uh, you know, this never-ending COVID crap, they're obviously going to still be pushing for mail-in ballots, which I think unless you're legitimately going to be away, or if you're a military person, they should do away with these uh, mail-in ballots. All voting should be done in person at the voting booth. It's the way we've done it for hundreds of hundreds of years. And uh, I also believe we need a federal voter ID law, where in order to vote, you have to show an ID and uh, now you got these idiots states like New York I think it's just New York City but that's bad enough that wants to let illegals vote and uh, my personal opinion any place that allows illegal aliens to vote they lose their electoral votes in the national election because if you allow illegals to vote in so-called local or state elections or whatever how do you stop them from voting in the uh, federal elections you can't so you know you gotta clamp down on this because you know, we've just about lost our country now, and uh, another election cycle, and with these people in charge, and this country is over. And, uh, you know, this COVID crap is just the beginning, you know, because this ain't about, this COVID shit isn't just about 
it, it isn't about public health at all. It's about being able to control every aspect of your life. Uh, you know, these forced vaccinations, which these shots aren't even safe. They haven't been tested long term. Trump rides with me. He's still my president. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're slowly but surely losing the country. And uh, actually, it isn't that slowly anymore. When we force these jabs on everybody. Uh, at least down here where I am, they're not totally crazy. We got a good governor that's, you know, made it so we have some freedom down here. And, uh, Echo 16, you still tip I think that's the only thing that's made this Ever. year, two years actually, bearable. Uh, the way I feel, if you want to get the shot, get the shot. If you don't want to get the shot, don't get the shot. Nobody should force anybody to inject something that's not even safe into your body. And I say it's not safe because... If you know where to look, you'll find a fax that heart attacks, strokes, blood clots, things like that, skyrocketed this year. And in fact, I read a post from a nurse that said their uh, hospital was full, not with uh, COVID patients, but with... Uh, People that are having bad re reactions to vaccines, the heart attacks, the strokes, the blood clots, you know, stuff like that, that they've never had before. People, all, all this and young people. So, you know, they haven't done any long-term studies on this. So... Why do they just want to force everybody to do this? You know, it's all about control. But, who knows? Anyway, I'm going to get going. Uh, I just wanted to make a quick video to let you all know I'm still alive and kicking. <laughs> and, uh, hopefully I'll uh, come up with some more content here and not go this long uh, between videos. Anyway, thanks for watching. Have a good night. God bless you. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.